Hey everyone, this is the restaurant review for the one Michelin star restaurant Gravitas in Ivy City of Washington, D.C. This restaurant is owned and chefed by Matt Baker. Some of his places that he has worked at before was Mini Bar and also a couple of places in Houston and also the D.C. area. So I opt for one of the menus, which was the chef summer garden menu. To start off the summer garden menu, I had some bubbly, a really nice uh, root that was dry in flavor, and also a cocktail from one of their menu items. We start off with a trio of canopies. The first was a chilled mango salad. The spoon item was a tartare of smoked salmon with a little bit of emulsion as if you were eating a cloud. The last was a summer squash velouté with a little bit of balsamic vinegar. All hit the mark, especially the smoked salmon to start off the meal. Their first course was Chef Matt Baker's signature course, which is a summer vegetable salad. All of the vegetables, herbs are from the conservatory, which is just upstairs from the restaurant itself. And oh, by the way, you can also stop here for some quick bites and cocktails. Unfortunately, during the pandemic, this was closed down. However, a beautiful display of technique of vegetables, some herbs including nasturtium, a white wine vinaigrette, and a espuma of goat cheese, which created a very light and playful way of eating your vegetables. Next was the Maryland crab salad. Now this was a cold salad, so it does have a little bit of green apple, lemon oil, some crab roe aioli from the crab itself, and a crab consomme that was poured on as a part of presentation. And here is the finished product. Next was a olive oil poached salmon with a little a bit of Carolina gold rice, tomato consomme, and a little bit of basil oil inside of the consomme that was also poured as a part of presentation. I love the very tender technique of poaching salmon or really any fish and Chef Matt did a great job with this. The Carolina gold rice was as if I was eating risotto and I think that was the aim. Next was one of my favorite courses and this was the Vietnamese spiced grilled quail served with a bed of wild rice salad, fermented turnips, sugar snap peas, and a onion broth that almost felt like you were eating a bowl of pho except no noodles. The quail was beautifully cooked, deboned pretty well, and it was a great reminder of my Vietnamese heritage. Next I had a choice between the sauteed flounder, the Korean barbecue eggplant, or the roasted wagyu ribeye. I opted for the flounder and this was a very artful presentation as seen here on this photo has a zucchini basil coulis, some black braised lentils which were scented with a little bit of octopus ink, some pickled baby tomatoes and a herbed brown butter. Very simple dish. I love the artful presentation, especially the contrast in the colors to include the black lentils and the zucchini coulis as well. And finally, my dessert was a very simple but also very flavorful stone fruit and rosemary. It started with rosemary poached peaches some macerated strawberries, a Arnold Palmer gelée, and finally a apricot honey sorbet. All of these were a whimsical approach of eating fruit in different textures, in different 
ways. I really like the gelée of the Arnold Palmer to kind of a little bit of tartness to counter the sweet from the sorbet. They also had a little bit of meringues for textural element. And finally, the Madaganese, which is usually just little bites at the end of a dinner service. I did opt for a wonderful espresso with these two wonderful bites, a Earl Grey scented marshmallow and a pecan praline nougat. Overall, a wonderful meal. Had an honor to talk to Chef Matt for a little bit. He did say that he is surviving the pandemic and actually doing a little better and hoping that he can open up the conservatory, which is upstairs, for more dining once things settle down. Overall, my experience at Gravitas was probably one of the best, especially a farm-to-table approach to the cuisine here in Ivy City. I love a lot of the uh, playful touches on the crab salad, the Vietnamese spiced quail, and especially the, the summer vegetable salad. Hey, thanks for watching. If you love this video, give it a thumbs up. Subscribe to the channel to get more information on this channel and also see more restaurant reviews, including more that are coming up in the D.C. area and also New Orleans and soon to be in New York City as well. Thanks for watching and I'll see you on the next video.